Yeah, Peter back at the porthouse. Well, I'm really happy that uh, a lot of people have been uh, enjoying the video of pounding the tiles. Like I say, you know, they're all over in Japan. They're just sitting on people's houses. So there's really no shortage of uh, these tiles. So there's plenty of uh, pounding that can be done. But I want to show you, uh, no, give you some uh, advice if you start doing it on uh, how to pound the perfect tile. So I've cleared, I've cleared the deck. And the first video I showed you, but I want to show you better the four different sledgehammers I got here. Now each one, like I said, has got a different job. So this one, uh, she was a good one for a while. This little round spot gave me some ideas on how to do a slight little chipper. Uh, but, uh, but it got loose and there's a problem there with her and uh, I don't want to use her anymore. Uh, for this work, so I'm setting her aside. And then uh, these two are my workhorses. Uh, she's a good, this is the heaviest one. And then uh, he's a nice one as well, but the handle is a, not quite as smooth as, as this one. So this has been my go-to, ah, I'm sorry. This is the go-to one. Uh, she's, uh, she feels the best and she cuts a good stone. But I just recently found this, a friend of mine, thought that uh, maybe I could uh, use this and I like her she's uh, she's good but uh, you know uh, a little bit uh, thin in the handle I like a thicker thicker handle so I'm not going to use that one for this video I'm going to use the one I usually use I set these aside and I'm going to show you how to pound a perfect tile so I've cleared the deck it's very important when I first started you know I took uh, two sledgehammers and I just started pounding them, pound, 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 and breaking them. And they went all, the stones went everywhere. As you can see, I, uh, I had quite an explosion here. I thought, that's not good. I ended up spending so much time picking up the stones that I uh, it was wasting time. And it was keeping me from my pounding. So as time progressed here, I've uh, come up with the, the best system. And that is you want to control control the rocks control the stone so you start right in the middle cracker and in the middle again and keep everything in the middle well a little bit wild there but now you can see the uh, outside ones outside ones keep the pieces in play here you don't want them flying all around so that's what i do over and over just work from the inside out and pound and enjoy. So if you have any questions or uh, want to get involved in the uh, in the great works here at uh, that board house, uh, uh, like I said, there's plenty of tiles. You can just see them everywhere in Japan. Uh, so get pounding. Be safe, everyone.